morning welcome to day two of vlogtober i'm probably not going to be able to keep count for very long <laughs> but this is day two i feel like that was too much lip balm <laughs> i am just getting ready it is 9 10 and i need to try to get ready as quickly as i can it is raining outside it's not storming but is it's definitely raining consistently and pretty hard so i don't know what the roads are like out there and arizona drivers are pretty crazy especially when it rains so i think i want to try to leave at 10 30 instead of almost 11 like i usually do just to give myself extra time yeah so i'm just gonna quickly get ready i don't think i'm gonna put on a ton of makeup anyway number one i'm teaching well i still put on makeup when i teach um but i don't need a lot and two it's raining so i don't want to put on a lot of beautiful makeup only to have it all wash off because <laughs> that would not be fun need some moisturizer so update on the ears <laughs> they feel completely fine they got a little sore last night um but i hesitate to even use the word sore because like compared to my fibro pain it was nothing it just it kind of had gotten to a point where i kind of felt like maybe that's sore maybe that's like maybe they're starting to feel bruised like i could just feel them slightly it was like a very very, 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 very dull, dull, dull ache. Almost to the point where, like, I doubted if I was actually even feeling what I thought I was feeling. So it was really, really minimal. But I was able to lay on them just fine. I was able to sleep on my side. I kind of had one of my really soft throw blankets kind of cradled around my head just to lift my head up slightly. I didn't wake up in the middle of the night in you know, suddenly large amounts of pain because I'd rolled onto my ear or something like that. So I was a little worried that like, and because I've never pierced my ears and because I worry about pretty much everything, I definitely put too much lip balm on. Because I've never done this before and because I worry about everything, I did think like, what if it snags on something while I sleep? What if I am like, you know, hitting my head in my sleep? Like. You know, what if, what if, what if, and then it was fine. Totally fine. So I feel like tonight I'll be a lot calmer and more chill about it all. And then this morning they feel absolutely fine. I've done the salt spray, the salt water spray. So I'll bring that with me in my bag and I'll do it a few times at school. I'm thinking about parking on campus and not in my usual spot that's another reason why i want to try to leave as early as possible and then i'll just go hang out in my office first if i have to but i might park in the garage near my office building just so that i'm not having to stand out in the rain waiting for the bus either you know the beginning of the day or at the end of the day i just don't think that would be fun or a very good idea day one of October is uploading now it did take me a while to edit it all so I'm gonna try to be mindful about how much I talk in these vlogs I do want to talk to you more than I usually get to in a weekly vlog but I think because I was so nervous last yesterday I was talking a lot so thought I would do a bit of a get ready with me today and chat with you now um, because once I'm on campus, it's really hard for me to vlog. And then um, I get home so late that there's not really much that happens after I get home. So Tuesdays and Thursdays for Vlogtober are going to be interesting, I think. Just uh, for me as a vlogger trying to get creative about what I vlog and what I share. So there's probably going to be some get ready with me's. There's probably going to be some get unready with me's. I need my water. I haven't eaten breakfast yet, so leaving early is going to be a bit of a trick today. Which is why I'm trying not to linger too much on makeup. I need powder. So I'm going to get ready, 
I'm just gonna probably end up whacking my hair up into another bun like it is now. But this is the one I slept in, so I definitely need to redo it. So, and then I'll eat breakfast right before I leave. I'll do that last thing, because I just do not get hungry first thing in the mornings. Like, it usually takes me a couple hours before I start to feel hungry. So, that's not great on an earlier morning when I'm trying to get out of the house quickly. It just throws off the whole schedule. I'm pretty much just using the basics in my drawer here, which is in my everyday makeup video. I can't remember if that was in a vlog or not, but it was earlier in the summer. I'll try to link it. I think the only thing I've used differently from that video is my Laranim Bewitched Sand Eyeshadow, and I don't know if I had the Becca Under Eye Corrector Brightener Concealer thing yet, which I love, and it like just makes this whole area look so much better. <laughs> Especially if I'm really tired on a particular day. Okay, I'm gonna take my hair down, and then I wanted to go take a selfie to put up today on Instagram with my new earring, earrings, to put up once the vlog goes up. So I'm just going to kind of fluff out my bun hair, go take that picture, and then come back and put my hair back up, essentially. <laughs> okay, I'm back. I think I got a semi-decent picture. Now it's time to whack this hair back up into a bun. Okay, I need to get some breakfast and get my shoes on. I think I'm gonna wear boots today just because of the rain. It'll probably be a little bit warm, but I'd rather be warm than soaking wet. Need to get some food, get my bag together, just finish up some bits, and then get on the road. Um, I keep, like, it doesn't hurt, but I just keep forgetting that they're there, and I don't want to be touching them all the time. Anyway, <laughs> I'm going to try not to be too obnoxious about, oh, I have earrings now. I'm sure no one is even going to notice. I did FaceTime my mom and my sister after I got home, and they both couldn't believe it. Like, I was holding the, the camera up so that they could see me, and I was just like, do you notice? anything different and both of them were like new glasses these are the same glasses I've been wearing for years now <laughs> I'm like no and they they kept looking and I was like then tilting my head a little bit more they both are looking harder and then they both have a moment of oh, your ears are pierced <laughs> I wish I'd gotten it on film because it was brilliant wish me luck I will update you at some point on where I managed to park and I will try to show you as much on campus but if it's raining I'm not going to get my camera out when I'm outside and that's usually where I've been vlogging on campus so we will just have to see what happens today. <laughs> okay I have made it to campus. Traffic well, traffic wasn't bad, and people were driving very, very sensibly. Like, I don't think anyone was going faster than 60, and it's 65 is the speed limit. So we were all going under the speed limit. I think I was doing, like, 55. So that was good. Everyone was driving sensibly. No one was being crazy. I've parked, not in my usual spot, but I'm in a parking garage. I'm on the roof but thankfully there's some solar panels. I've got my big umbrella and I'm, I'm right on campus. So I'm right across the street from my building um, and then my classroom is just a little bit beyond that. So I'm gonna go, I'm here early. I made it down here, it's 11.10. My class isn't until noon, so I've got about 50 minutes. So I think I'm gonna go into my office building, hang out there for a bit and then walk to camp, walk to my classroom. That will hopefully keep me a little bit drier. But I'm gonna get inside and I will check check in with you guys later.
I mean, you guys are in the cabinet. Sorry about that. I just needed to push you somewhere. I am home late. It is 7.20. I've been home for a few minutes, but I got home after 7 o'clock. I need to do dishes so badly. We're just going to pretend like those don't exist because I can't deal with them right now. I'm making leftover chili, or rather I'm heating it up, and I've got biscuits as well. I just made drop biscuits because I messed up the recipe when I made them on Sunday. Put in too much milk, so then I added a bit of extra flour, and it just, I could tell it wasn't gonna roll out. I was gonna use a cookie, a little cutter, cookie cutter, to make shapes, and that just wasn't going to work. They still taste good. Oh, I need my water bottle. <sighs> Forgot my water bottle in my bag. My throat is killing me. I think between probably allergies from all of this rain, and then all of the talking I did, my throat is just done. Definitely need to do the dishes before I go over to my parents' house tomorrow. <laughs> Should probably make some tea for myself tonight. That would probably make my throat feel better. It kind of started to clear up. We briefly saw some blue sky and then it clouded over again. And during my last class, it was just getting so dark. <laughs> outside. I'm used to having a lot of natural light coming in and it just wasn't, it wasn't happening. Um, so it's making it feel so much later. I finally got back to my car by about 6.30 and then it took me a little more than 30 minutes to get home. I had to get off the highway a few exits sooner than I usually do because the sign was saying that the exit before my normal one, the road or the highway was flooded. I don't know if it was an old sign and it was just still running and so I don't know if it was still actively flooding or not but I thought I'm not gonna risk it I'm just gonna get off the highway and take the main roads it took me a little bit longer than usual to get home I'm glad to be home and in my PJs and I'm ready to eat a yummy dinner and just relax I will possibly talk to you one more time Probably not. I might just include some clips after this bit of the rest of my evening <laughs> so you can see. And then I will probably just say goodnight to you now so that I don't have to edit another long chatty clip. So thank you for watching day two. I hope you enjoyed it. Subscribe if you are not subscribed so you don't miss tomorrow and the rest of Vlogtober. Give the vlog a thumbs up if you liked it. I would really appreciate that. And I will see you all tomorrow in the next vlog. Thanks for watching this one. Bye-bye. Or not bye-bye. Stay. There'll be a couple more clips, but I'm I'm done talking now. I'm done talking now. <laughs>